Figure we could all use a little comedy here. Are you sick and tired of your calm, peaceful life? Are you sleeping too well at night? Is your city too safe? Well, not anymore. Introducing Democrats. Politicians so incompetent, they'll fill your neighborhood with riots. Looting. Rampant violence. And even homelessness. The secret is a special blend of corruption and good old-fashioned stupidity. No more pesky law and order. When Democrats are in charge, nobody's safe. Simply vote for Democrats, sit back, and watch your neighborhood burn to the ground. But wait, vote for Democrats now, and they'll include rolling blackouts, election fraud, cancel culture, taxes, and more taxes. Democrats, bring right to your front door. Are you sick and tired of your calm, peaceful life? <laughs> Biden's approval rating is negative seven. It's gone down in the last few days for obvious reasons. Um, John Kerry put out a, uh, had a press conference and was talking about the pipeline and the jobs and the oil industry and coal and fracking and said, oh, well, people need better choices. They can all go work in the solar power panel, or solar panel uh, industry. Look, I've known some pipe pitters in my life. I worked at a shipyard in my early 20s. I don't know a single pipe fitter who would want to sit in a factory and do tedious solar panel work. These are rough, tough, outdoor guys. They're not going to want us to do that job. Beside the fact it pays like half the amount of money that they make. These people are insane. They have lost their mind. Why not instead invest in Elon Musk and his new program to find somebody who can remove carbon from fossil fuel burning? That would be something. Keep the oil independence so we don't wind up having to start new wars in the Middle East because that's what it's all about. That's why we have wars in the Middle East. And remain oil independent. And then I hear today Biden has written a EO, one of his over 30 EOs that he's written in a few days that he said, oh, well, executive orders are being a dictator. Yeah, yeah, exactly. You're dictating to us what you think we should have. None of us want. But he put one in today or a couple of days ago that said you can't use the words China virus. Are you kidding me? You can't infringe on our rights to speak. When in the world did you get the idea? Where in the world did you get the idea? That you could supersede the Constitution and our freedom of speech. These people are insane. These people are bat crap crazy. Anyway... This little um, video might be funny. A friend of mine sent me. It might be cute. But it's actually more truthful than it is comedy. And that's one of the problems we have. Serious issue. So all I have to say is, come on, military. Come on, military. Come on, generals. Do you think we're awake enough yet?